Hey yo everyone, welcome back to another Terraria video. Today we are torturing some more NPCs, you know, one of my favorite things to do in Terraria. So the NPCs we're going to be torturing, I mean, uh, putting against each other in a 1v1 battle. It is some new NPCs that we have never used before or ones we just really haven't used too often, but possibly used in the past. But I've downloaded some mods specifically that add in, you know, new NPCs here. Let me change the UI size so we can just see some of them a little bit more clearly. And, uh, you know, a couple of the mods I have are the lumberjack npc mod which adds in a lumberjack and then we got the pick lock npc which adds in an npc that picks locks we got this right here the architect npc i don't even know if that's a mod i already had installed or not but there's that uh we got the luminite merchant from the luminite npc mod so that's like four npcs right there we also have the spirit mod installed which adds in a bunch of npcs and you know we usually see the uh thorium and the vanilla npcs and some calamity npcs here and there but today you know we're putting a bunch of the new Comers to the test and we're gonna see how they battle and hopefully these npcs have attacks in general because if they don't attack or just have bad attacks then uh well i don't know how this is gonna go so we're gonna start off with spirit mod npcs because i feel like those two you know they might be able to battle a little bit better i feel like the spirit mod npcs probably have a little bit better battling ai but yeah if you guys want to know how to make npcs fight download the npc combat mod made by rev miami shout out to him and as you can see our arena here is a little bit updated i, I just used some calamity block that's it they look cool so that's why i use them all right so we have the martian sciences npc and the enchanter npc both from the spirit mod and uh, let's put them to the test it's time for another battle you know i think we're just gonna do 1v1s and if any fight is super close or unique you know maybe we'll change it up i think honestly i, I should open up the arena but uh let's see this first fight you know they're both shooting beams which isn't the most interesting attack but it's all good shout out to the enchanter for winning that fight here's your reward you can go swim in the lava down below i'm gonna remove these barriers just to give them a little bit more uh, room to fight and when i say a little bit more room to fight we're just opening the barriers so that they fall in the lava all right we got our next two combatants the uh, i don't know lunatic i think and the rogue both from the spear mod again hopefully their attacks are different please let their attacks be different oh my god his attacks seem a little strong the the rogue didn't even get a chance to throw anything so i think we got to put the rogue to the test again all right so the rogue is gonna go against this dude right here what is this dude <laughs> the the lone trapper npc so let's see oh there you go he's got throwing stars damn he actually drops the throwing stars too the uh trapper here seems to have like some spirit arrows he shoots out oh he gotta put up a fight if he wants to live oh my god oh my god the comeback from the lone trapper who had lower health and was further off the edge you hate to see it i think the rogue just sucks so we got one more npc from the spirit mod and is the adventurer i believe his name is and then we got casimir of course the second channel mascot next to the mushroom if you guys don't know it's the orange dude i be playing as an rl craft and is this orange dude right here casimir the one and only shout out to mo gaming who i believe is the one who made casimir's day off and uh let's let's see casimir put up to the test against this adventure hopefully it is an even fight we'll see though i know casimir is really fast and i don't know what oh, okay like i said i was hoping that it was gonna be even a fight i don't even know if i said that but i knew casimir was gonna win we have the lumberjack npc robbie versus the locksmith Matthew, <laughs> or is that just matthew spelt really weird i don't know but yeah we got these two dudes they're just trying to get to work and i caught their asses and now they're gonna fight to the death so let's see who will come out on top the locksmith or the lumberjack let's do it let's see him in action no i think the lumberjack's gonna come with that heat the slow run up to the locksmith oh he, he's using an axe as expected i thought he was even gonna throw the axe but now nah, he's, he's going with the full melee approach the locksmith has a gun i don't know if that's uh correct to his lore but the lumberjack like i said he came with the heat he just walked up to him with an axe and he beat his ass so if you're playing rock paper scissors the axe always wins all right next up here we got the architect npc and the luminite npc which if you don't know what the luminite npc does he sells luminite i know who would have thought let's go ahead let's start this fight uh, i feel like the luminite npc is just gonna beat this dude's ass i don't know he looks like a primordial being so we'll see will they even fight each other i don't know they're both staring at something to the right there must be something really interesting over there hey man we need you to fight ludwig come on ludwig come on look oh oh my god he pulled out a sand cannon where'd you get that from the illuminati npc was shooting first but now he's not shooting at all 
Oh, I try to catch him. I try to catch him to give him a fair fight because I did put Ludwig very close. Oh, did you see that? He tried to shoot a bullet on his way out. You know what? Let's let's do another round of these two. All right, round two of these two because the fight I feel like wasn't that fair because I moved Ludwig very close. But at this time, we're going to move my boy Sean here a little bit closer. See if he hits him at all. He's having, having trouble with the aim. There we go. Nice shot right there. Come on. You got to get in there, Lewis. You got to get in there. I don't want people just getting knocked off the edge all the time. This is the problem with the NPC battles. People are getting knocked off of the edge. Come on. Get in there face to face he's just running away get in there oh there we go he took out the sand cannon he has sean on the run will he actually shoot him you have a ranged weapon you know that right but he has to get a certain range to shoot the ranged weapon which is not that good but he may win the fight again oh my god i tried to catch my boy sean it's too late damn he starts shooting when he's dead he shoots a little too late let's do some mixing and matching here you know to see some different combos and uh hopefully some intense fights no, throughout. Wait a minute. Wait a damn minute. I didn't hear any lava. So that means he's still alive. Oh my god, he's running so fast. Look at that. Casimir is still alive. So you know what that means. Oh, I accidentally hit his head in the lava. He gets a part two. Hey, get down from there, you cheater. He gets a round two. More of a second life rather than a round two. Go ahead, Casimir. Show him what you're about. Somebody show him what. Oh. He's still alive. You know what that means. Oh, oh my god, he's out. He ran all the way over there. I don't really feel like chasing him. I have taken two different Lumberjack NPCs from two different mods. And let's see which one's going to be better. The Lumberjack NPC from the Lumberjack NPC mod or the Lumberjack NPC from the Fargo's Mutant mod. Let's see. I think the one... Oh, he hit himself. What does he throw? What the hell does he throw? He's throwing something dangerous. Hey, if he kills himself, that's a fair fight right there. <laughs> I swear this lumberjack NPC threw axes, but I don't know. Let's see. Let's get him closer. Dude, he's just killing himself. Here, stand right next to him. Did he even get a hit on or did the dude hit himself? All right, you know what? That, that lumberjack was a failure. I know who I'm buying my wood from. Let's see some more crazy matchups here. We got the uh, Deviant NPC and we got the Abomination NPC. I believe that's their names. They're very ugly, both of them. So this is a perfect matchup, right? No idea what these two NPCs do. Oh my, oh my. <laughs> what the hell did I just witness? Was that a tie or did the Abomination win first? Okay, I think we got to run that one back because I have no idea what just happened, to be honest. Okay, okay. That was just, I think the Abomination wins because that was just a pure like sweep right there. I don't even think the Deviant got a chance to shoot. How is her head floating? All right, we're going to do a weird one here. We got the uh, mutant himself versus the mutant himself. So let's see how this works. They're both shooting the eyeballs that make each other float. But it seems the one to the right one, the one to the right weirdest died. No, wait, the one to the left? I don't know. I'm confused. All right, we got some more Calamity NPCs here. Like I said, these are a lot of NPCs that I've barely used and uh, some that we've barely seen fight each other. I know the Calamity NPCs are really strong though. So let's see what happens here. Let's see what kind of chaos. Oh my God, he damn near killed both of them. Or he damn near, oh, they killed each other. Okay, I didn't even get to say what happened. All right, we'll, we'll call that a draw. All right, we're putting uh, Amadeus, I think that's his name, Amidius, Amadeus, whatever. We're putting him 1v1 against himself. He's a big serpent boy. Wow, really bad aim. Dude, come on. You guys are literally an inch off. Let me just move you a little bit closer. But look, once they start hitting each other, they run away. Look at that. Come on, you can't be running away. Does that explode over time? Like, why does it say latched onto him? Okay, this fight is not interesting either. We have our next fight here. The Illuminate NPC versus the Hard Mode Guide NPC, which, you know, these two look very similar. So I'm assuming they use the same model or something. I don't know. Let's see them fight, though. The Hard Mode Guide has a cooler attack, but, you know, the Illuminate NPC is a newbie and uh, may want to show himself or show that they have the power to take on some of these NPCs. Or I'll just delete the mod and we'll never see him again after this episode. But we'll see. Yeah, good fight you're putting up there. And you're dead. All right, that, that mod may be removed in future iterations of NPC combat videos. All right, we got some more NPCs we never see. I don't even know what these two NPCs do. One shoots fireballs, the other throws knives. You know, this is the Clintaminator NPC from the Solutions mod, and that's a really good mod. You would expect her to use a Clintaminator like a flamethrower or something, but no. She throws, throws knives, kind of boring. You know, I hope in the, oh, she's dead. I hope in the future, you know, people that make NPC mods give them a little bit more interesting attacks, much like the Thorium NPCs. But yeah, next we got these two from the news mini boss NPC mod, which is a great quality of life mod. Pretty much considered cheating. All quality of life mods are cheating if you think about it. But yeah, let's see these two. They do the exact same move. It's just who does it better and more accurate. So far, it seems like the wizard on the right is doing the best, but I don't know. He, he's missing now. I think it's whoever hits them, hits, gets hit next is dead. 
dead. Uh oh. Oh man, he's not even. Sta oh. Oh man, that was almost a draw. The timing on that was impeccable. But uh, Falbert, he lost first. All right, I think we're doing one final fight, maybe another final fight after this, testing out some stronger NPCs. We got the one from Calamity, which shot the white beam that killed everyone in that NPC battle royale video, which I might do another one of soon. And we got the Fargo mutant who shot the eyeball that does a lot of damage. And you know, he killed himself, even though it was a one v one against himself. Let's see it in action though. These two are very strong. Let's see him in action. Oh. Fargo missing the first hit. There's still battling going off. He is not burning at all. Oh God, he killed himself. <laughs> He killed himself. All right, congratulations, Permafrost. You win this. All right, last but not least, the drunken princess versus the deviant. Let's see. Oh, oh, she killed herself, but also, okay, I don't. <laughs> interesting, interesting. Gave her the power of love. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to leave a comment with some more uh, NPC mods. I know there's a couple of mods with NPCs that I've never tested out. Uh, Sacred Tools would be another one that we can add in the future. Uh, Ancients Awaken, Elements Awoken, you know, a couple other mods that add in a couple of NPCs here and there. But if there's any like NPC mods specifically, you know, one that adds in one NPC, much like the Lumberjack one, you know, let me know. Let me know in the comments so we can have some more battles with new faces we never seen. Is this dude all right? My boy, he's either dancing or he's having a panic attack. But yeah. I got some more Terraria videos coming, of course, with some more Minecraft videos. I am slowly working on that uh, Minecraft, turning Minecraft into Terraria, much like we turned Terraria into Minecraft. But that's going to take a little bit because I'm trying to find everything for that. And uh, I might have to do some digging for old Minecraft mods because I know there was a Terraria mod in the past for Minecraft that added in like the Destroyer and a bunch of other things, I believe. I think there's actually a couple of mods that did that, but they're for like way older versions of Minecraft. So yeah, that, that might take a little bit to, you know, set up and do everything for. I also have a really big Terraria video that i've been working on for a while it just there's a lot of setting up and a lot of stuff i gotta talk about for that video but that'll be coming soon i'll be sure to sprinkle in some videos here and there of terraria though but yeah make sure you guys leave a like on the video make sure to follow my twitch my twitter join my discord and check out my second youtube channel where i post full live streams from my twitch i love you guys i'll see you next time merry christmas i hope you're enjoying the uploads i'm trying to go hard before christmas you know as a christmas presents for me to you and also thank you for 160k subs i love you